Let's take some rules of exponents and combine them. 2x squared y to the fourth z cubed all of that to the fourth power times 3x to the ninth y to the fifth z all of that to the third power. Well the first thing I need to do is in each of these pieces distribute in a sense their exponents. So I need to do 2 to the fourth x to the 2 times 4 y to the 4 times 4 and z to the 3 times 4. Remember, what does it mean to do 2 to the 4th? That's 1, 2, 3, 4 2's all being multiplied together. Okay, 2 times 2 is 4, times 2 is 8, times 2 is 16. So I have a coefficient of 16, x to the 2 times 4, well that's x to the 8th, y to the 4 times 4, that's y to the 16th, and z to the 3 times 4, that's z to the twelfth. Well, now I have to do the other half. I'm going to, in a sense, distribute this cubed power. So I need to find out what 3 to the third is. x to the 9 times 3, y to the 5 times 3, and z to the, uh-oh, invisible 1 times 3. Don't forget that invisible 1. Well, a 3 cubed is 3 times 3 times 3, which is 9 times 3, which is 27. So I have the whole number 27. x to the 9 times 3 is 27. y to the 5 times 3 is 15. And z to the 1 times 3 is 3. But remember, according to that little dot, I need to take these two answers and multiply them together. So I need to find out what 16 times 27 is. Hmm. Let's use our calculator to save a little time. 16 times 27 is 432. And remember the rule here is that I'm going to add my exponents. What's 8 plus 27? That's x to the 35. y to the, what's 16 plus 15? That's 31. And z to the, what's 12 plus 3? That's 15. So the final answer is 432x to the 35th, y to the 31st, z to the 15th. Whew. Long problem. All right, let's try the next one. Take this cube, distribute it through the entire quantity. So I need to do 4 cubed, x to the 9 times 3, y to the invisible 1 times 3, and z to the... 3 times 3. On this problem, we'll be distributing that 5. So we'll be finding 2 to the 5th, x to the 5 times 5, y to the 9 times 5, and z to the 3 times 5. Now that I gave you the first step on each side, maybe you should pause the video and give it a try. 4 cubed means 4 times 4 times 4. 4 times 4 is 16 times 4 is 64. x to the 9 times 3 is 27. y to the 1 times 3 is 3. z to the 3 times 3 is 9. Times 2 to the 5th means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 twos all being multiplied. 2 times 2 is 4. Times 2 is 8. Times 2 is 16. Times 2 is 32 x to the 5 times 5 is 25, y to the 9 times 5 is 45, z to the 3 times 5 is 15. So now we need to find out what 64 times 32 is. Handy dandy calculator tells me that that is 2048, x to the 27 plus 25, that's 52. y to the 3 plus 45, that's 48. z to the 9 plus 15, that's 24. There you go. Okay, here's four problems for you to try. Problem A. 
4, x to the 3rd, y to the 7th, z to the 9th, all of that cubed, times 2, x cubed, y to the 5th, z to the 7th, all of that to the 5th power. Problem B. 10, x squared, y to the 3rd, z to the 4th, all of that to the 4th power times 2, x to the third, y, z to the third, all of that squared. Your third problem, problem c. 2x squared, y to the fourth, z to the third, all of that to the sixth power, times 2x squared, y, z, all of that to the fourth power. And finally, d, a challenge problem. 10, x to the 4th, y to the 9th, z, all of that cubed, times 2, x to the 3rd, y, all of that squared, times 4, x, z, all of that squared. I want you to show all of your work on these four problems like I showed all of my work on the video.